Hey, I just want to share how I do uh, QA with automation uh, for us work. I've sh talked about this before. I just want to show it more in action now. And so what we do is we want to get to a place where every time we add new features to the site or fix things, we don't have to keep testing it manually. So, you know, we want to uh, add jobs and whatnot and see if people can see them and set proposals and who cannot. Now, this is the live site and I'm pushing test data into it. Not ideal. I just, I just got to get my act together and make the staging site. Uh, but what I use is browser use. And I use browser use because it has an API. So uh, if you just go here and uh, use browser use, um, you can just write things down and it will do the work for you. Very natural language. But since I want to automate it, I want N8N to trigger for me. Now, I could have it trigger whenever I push code to GitHub, or I could have it um, trigger code when I send a message to it from Mattermost. Um, I could do it every day. Like, it just depends. And once it triggers, it will use a prompt I made in a Google Doc. And so that Google Doc is just a prompt. It just goes through all the steps that I need to do to test, make a job, log out, go into someone who um, doesn't have a subscription. Can they pr pr reply to the job? Blah, blah, blah. And so it runs, it gets that prompt and then runs it using the API of browser use. So uh, it just hits that API and uh, gives it the particular content and it's done. And then when it is done, uh, because the prompt says at the bottom of it to reply back to here, whether it's pass or fail, then it will send it pass or fail. And so at that point, um, the... I will get a message in Mattermost saying pass or fail, and I can do something if it's a fail. Uh, and that's really it. Um, that is how we go through automation. Now, and then you'll see it can go through. Now, I think, I don't know if you can watch it live, um, but you can just see it goes through all the steps we were talking about. And if it failed at one spot, we can come back and look. All right, just wanted to share that. It's it's really neat tool, browser use. Not too expensive if you consider all the time it saves to for QA. All right. Thank you.